Hey, what's going on guys? So right now, I'm going to show you the best money making method in the game and it will most likely be the best for a really long time. It's most players that are veterans know about this method, but just in case you didn't, here I am to tell you. So what is this method? Basically, all this method is, is just abusing the price of peaches. They're so expensive, dude. Like you can sell them for so much per peach. It's so easy to make a good farm out of it, and that's what we're going to do today. So first of all, we're going to answer the question, how do you get peaches? Well, if we come up here, if you have, like, any plant really, it doesn't have to be eggplants, it could be literally any plant um, in the game, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have the actual plant itself. It can't be seeds, it has to be the plant itself, right? You're going to want to have a breed improvement plant here you're gonna need a breed improvement plant now i'm just gonna go over here for the next part of the video so what you're gonna do with this breed improvement plant is you're gonna place it down and as you see if you put eggplants into it there's a little chance of getting uh, a cabbage sheet now you want to go by stars so there's a little chance to get the next star right you're gonna want to keep doing this over and over you're gonna want to you know get this cabbage seed eventually you're gonna want to plant that cabbage seed get the cabbage from it and then come back and put it in here until you get up to peaches um i'll just give you a little example see when you have this gives you a random chance of getting one of those things that showed on the screen and what did we get we got eggplants again see so you're gonna have to do that for a while it's kind of annoying and tedious but it does pay off or if you already have a, sh uh, a peach from level 7 dungeon grinding something like that you'll be fine um so this farm will just basically be using normal stacked farms uh we'll be making it automatic and we'll be using peaches as seen here i have a farm like this if we can pull up my peach sheets i have a farm where i just throw the peach sheets it automatically waters it um, and then they get pulled in to this chest right here and I have all my peaches there and all my markets there So I'm just gonna show you just in case you haven't seen the other videos I want to show you how to do it. So basically What you're gonna want to do you're gonna want to have one conveyor belt You're gonna point it any direction really it doesn't really matter um, You're gonna have eight farming plots at least eight or six is fine I guess really depends on how much you want uh, I'll go with six for this video one two three four five six now once we have that we're going to want to have door frames now we're using door frames because the rotational saws cannot get out of the door frames but the um the uh, absorbers can absorb through these door frames like they can because there's an open space so you're going to want to go like this go like this go like this go like that with the door frames it's a bit off center because we put it on the ground uh there's many ways of stacking farming plots this is the way i'm going to be using for this video but yeah that's basically that so now what we're going to want to do is put down a sprinkler uh just in the proximity i guess to be able to do it we're going to want to have a rotational saw we're going to want to place that down He can't escape because of the, the windows or the doors. Now, there's two ways of doing this next part. You can either hook it up to a market, just like this, and put some absorbers on the market, which is what most people do. Over here, I have a chest on top of a seed extractor because it's the perfect height. And these are stacks of eight or nine, I think. Um, that's what I do. But for the sake of this video, I'll just do the simpler method, which is putting some absorbers on this doesn't really matter how many absorbers i'm gonna put quite a few because i want to make sure that it gets the peaches you know it doesn't really matter how far away you put it as long as it absorbs in there it just makes it easier um and then once you have your peach seeds because you did the breed improvement plant stuff over there you're just gonna do that and let it grow you can just stay afk farming you know make it so you have an auto clicker that right clicks every like minute or something um, and you can make lots of money so easily just to give you an example of how much money you'll be making Let me take all the peaches here I'm also gonna fill this up again Let me take all the peaches in here as well and let me sell all of them 
Let me just show you guys how much you got. So we got about 905, right? 905 peaches. For 800 peaches, you get 6.7 million. 6.7 million. That is insane. It only takes like 10, 5 minutes to get that. Depending on how often you right click and throw your seeds. 6.7 million. Then we'll sell the rest just to get them out of here. 882,000. They are worth 8,400 each. I really hope that they don't nerf this price because if they do, the economy is going to crash and Craftopia, guys. Um, might have to resort back to my silver farm, <laughs> which is so inferior compared to this. Yes, this farm's a bit active, but it's so worth it just to throw a couple seeds down every once in a while and you get so much money. That's been this video, guys. I hope this helps you out. Um, we'll also be getting money from here. Let's see how many pieces we got. 453k just from one seed one seed got 453,000 that is insane plant another one real quick but that's all guys um that's literally all there is to it that's it the hardest part is getting the peaches themselves that's all you that's all i have to say about that uh, i hope you guys have a wonderful day i hope this method helps you out a ton it's literally what every player is using right now literally every player so Take advantage of it while it lasts. Get as much money as you can. As many wads of banknotes. As many banks filled. Just get all the money you can. It's so good. Alright. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.